Hola amigos, Ghost here, and today we're continuing our Let's Play of Spider-Man. Today is episode 28, and we're continuing on with the main story, since that is all we have to do left, since all the side stuff, as you can see on screen, has been completed, and we're basically approaching the very end of this game. We have only a few more of the Sinister Six to deal with, which we're going about to do, deal with uh, two more of them, and basically after that, we're almost done with Act 1. Pick on someone your own size, Rhino. There is no one my size, folk. Or maybe we could just talk it out. Rhino, what's your oh God. team up? I you were a loner. Oh, I did. I, I crap. I did that too early. Oh, come on, big fella. Come on. Boop, got your ass. So, what's the end for these particular means? Come on. Oh, no. Oh, come on, bitch. Let's wrap this up. Never send an eight-ton infant to do a man's job. Let's finish this. Gladly. Sports love you, but you do know it's rude to cut in, right? Oh, oh fuck. If I didn't show him, beg him to give up? Yes, Garkin, that is exactly what I would have done. Ah, like an old married couple, you two. Oh fuck! I wasn't expecting y'all to dink. Got run. Come on, come on, right now. Oh no! Missed. Come on, come on, hit me. Missed. Come on. Oh, miss. Did I knock him out that soon? Damn! Scorpion's weaker than I remember. That ended way quicker than I remember it did when I first played right, this game. Gary, that's four down. Just Octavius and Lee left. Something tells me they won't be as easy. They're only half our problem, though. Devil's Breath cases are getting worse, and Oscorp is being coy about an anti serum. I'm worried they're seeing dollar signs in a seller's market. I'd expect nothing less from our beloved mayor. Leave Devil's Breath to me, or my best people is on it. Pete, hey. I've been through the city, state, and federal databases. If this Devil's Breath lab does exist, it's off the books. The only other place I can think to look is in Norman's personal files. I've already been through his office computer. Are you thinking his penthouse? That building's full of Sables, man. If they spot me, other residents could get hurt in a firefight. I know, but I might be able to get in undetected. I can sneak in, find the lab's location, and get out. If anything goes wrong, I'll call you for backup. Okay, it's risky, but we need that location. Wait for me to get nearby, then make your move. I'll be ready. But yeah, from what I remember, that fight took about another 8 to 10 minutes. Maybe it's because back then I was worse at the game? Like, this is ultimate difficulty. We have a return caller who recently raised concerns about stable agents abusing their authority. Let's find out. Are things any better? There's less people complaining. You know why? 
because anyone who does disappears. You seen all these Sable bases popping up around town? I heard they're prison camps for anyone who steps out of line. I've heard those rumors as well. And while I initially thought it was fear-mongering, something I have absolutely no patience for, I have grown increasingly concerned. Why won't they let me in to inspect their bases? What are they hiding? We still abide by the Constitution, folks, and that includes protection against unreasonable searches and seizures and freedom of speech. So if you have concerns, if you see abuses happening, call me. If the authorities won't listen, I will. And I will spread the word to our fellow New Yorkers. If these tyrants think they can silence me, let them try. No one puts a muzzle on J. Jonah Jameson. Sometimes I wish someone could do that to you. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. But, uh, yeah. This is not an ultimate difficulty. Y'all saw in the first episode. But, yeah, that boss fight was probably the easiest of all of them. I had a harder time with Electro and Vulture. I don't know. Maybe it's... Maybe I'm just got better at the game. Like, I'm actually pretty decent at the game all of a sudden or something. Because that was super quick. Scorpion lasted, like, two combos at the most. Okay, MJ. I'm a couple blocks away. Let me know if you get into trouble. Thanks, Pete. Wish me luck. Okay. Norman's penthouse is on the top floor, but the elevator's on lockdown. Need to get into the security room to unlock it. Mayor Osborne really lives here? I never see him. Yeah. There's the security room. But that guard will see me if I go in. Residents are pretty upset. Maybe I can rile them up to create a distraction. Maybe. Why isn't Osborne down here? This sort of thing never happens to him. The mayor and his friends are exempt. Security let one of his biggest donors back upstairs right away. I knew it. It's all one big boys club. Come on. Oh, every second we stay down here, we risk catching that plague. Definitely stay away from the receptionist. Been coughing up a storm. What? They have to let us back upstairs. You can't treat us like Left animals. my stupid inhaler upstairs. I heard they'll let you up if you claim special circumstances. The health emergency might do it. Really? Come on, let's go talk to security. That should Think that's do enough? It. Jerry, get out here. We got a situation. Oh man, I can't breathe. Let me back up. Security upstairs. room's open. Just need to get to the door without being seen. Everyone, please stay calm. Sable International has nearly finished their sweep. That's what you said an hour ago. I know this is frustrating, but please remember, Sable is doing this for your safety. Ooh, a taser. Well, I know a few Sable agents who would love to meet you. <laughs> Assassin's like Assassin. Gotta turn him around. Watch out. I guess what, buddy? Good boy. Buzz. I'm sure Sable offers workman's comp. Elevator controls in the security room. Next to the Sable agent. Mary Jane Watson? Super spy. Time to unlock that elevator. That did it. Norman's clearing out, and the elevator's unlocked. Time to head upstairs. Penthouse elevator. This is it. Norman and Sable, right on cue. Find the alarm technician. Stupid useless button. Norman's 
Ryan's guards have all cleared out. If he's hiding something up here, I'm gonna find it. Uh, trying to remember. Lock till the system check finishes. It's over by uh, his wife. Paint the wife, his wife's painting and all that. What? Yep, there's something right here. Uh oh. Blueprint for the apartment. Tons of empty space right behind the wall with a family portrait. Who leaves space unused in a Manhattan apartment? Obviously hiding something. What else? MJ, stable presence downstairs just ballooned. I think Norman's being moved. Worried they might spot me. I might have had something to do with that. Keep your distance. I should be okay for now. What is this thing? Whoa, this mask is incredible. Is it showing a door hidden in that wall? Wonder where it leads. Hmm. Schematics for a prototype combat mask. Looks like it can reveal structural weaknesses. That definitely might be like a hint to the green. I don't know. It doesn't look like the Green Goblin mask, but it much very much looks like a prototype. The fabulous Osborne boys. Norman bids his son farewell. Hmm. This must be from when Harry left for Europe last year. Secret keypad behind the family portrait. Norman must like spy movies. We need to find the code for that keypad. Hmm. Probably. Probably has to deal with something with his son. Unless we the get, put this back on. The schematic. Yeah, I know, but I, would, uh, I guess it doesn't uh, show what I thought it might look, show. Uh, oh, over here. Scientific journals debating the Spider-Man problem. <laughs> so weird there's a whole cottage industry focused on explaining Pete's powers. Weirder still that Norman is such an active part of it. Uh, where else? Not there, I think. Unless I missed something else. No, it doesn't look like it. Um... Where else could be something? Can't go the, over here. Over here? Maybe? Nope. Nope. Uh, is there something here? Nope. Nope. Ah, oh, shit. Come on. Where what else could there be? Because the only thing I'm seeing is those, that, and that. Let me do this again. Maybe there's something else. It doesn't show anything. Damn it. And this doesn't show anything else other than those two damn things. Where is it? I know there's like a letter or something. Unless we have to go back through here. No, it doesn't look like it. Fuck. I'm lost. Oh no. Wait, wait, what, what the f- How did I miss this? Work order for a keypad lock. Looks like he used Harry's last day as the code. That must be the day Harry left for Europe. Uh, probably. Don't know what day that is, so you're gonna have to do that for me. Why are we going over here? I could be back any minute. Need to find that keypad code. I forgot about this. The Osbournes have a coat of arms and a motto Pax in Bello, Peace in War. <sighs> Gotta remember that if I ever write a book about. Harry said his mom used to cook all the time. 
You'd be surprised if Norman has ever even touched the stove. This room smells like... rich people. Wonder if all this wine is from Norman's vineyard in Burgundy. This motherfucker got a fucking vineyard in Burgundy? What the fuck? When you rich as hell. When you really rich. Damn. Motherfucker got a vineyard. Uh, okay, okay. Uh, won't be in there. Wait. Hey, Maybe Dad. The... On my way to Dr. Michaels for one last shot before the, um, the big trip. Um, hey, if you're gonna meet me there, could you grab my journal from my room? I just wanted to record some thoughts on the big Bon Voyage day. <laughs> uh, anyway. I know I don't say this enough, but thank you, Dad, you know, for doing this. I love you. Wow. Haven't heard Harry's voice in so long. He sounds so tired. Let's hope that journal is still here. Gotta check his room. Indeed. Pretty sure he's in a state of emergency, but Norman still manages to get his laundry and cleaning done for him. What a hero. Yeah, there's nothing here but that big ass TV. God, Pete and I loved coming over here to watch movies when we were kids. A different world from Queens. Funny how Harry always wanted the opposite. Nothing made him happier than watching cartoons on the little TV in May's kitchen. Alright, let's go. Harry's Wait. room. But it's locked. I used to be so jealous of Harry's family. They were so happy. At least compared to me and my dad. But when Emily got sick, everything changed. Do I not enter that room? Okay. Wait, what's this? Emily's terminal diagnosis. I knew Harry's mom was sick, but I had no idea it was genetic. Did Harry ever get tested? No, I don't think he got tested. Or he did. But a certain, uh, symbiote messed with him. Norman and Otto. Wow. They look like they used to be so close. What could have ruined a friendship like this? Uh, from our perspective, Osborne may have screwed over Otto, or it could have been vice versa type shit. Harry's mom, Emily. We used to make fun of him for calling her the prettiest mom at Midtown, but he might have been right. Feels like there's something attached to the back of the frame. Norman's bathroom is bigger than my entire apartment. Now I feel sad. Well, that's what happens when you have a uh, rich... Norman would have a pool. New York is about subway rats and street pizza. Not sunbathing and umbrella drinks. Alright, I think... Uh... <laughs> There's supposed to be something that we're supposed to mess with, but I'm not sure where it is. Do I have to go through that door, maybe? Oh man, look at us. We used to be so carefree. I miss those days. Hmm, Harry used to wear glasses too. Interesting. Okay, I can't go through there. Shit. I'm lost. Oh no. Because I don't think I can enter this door. Uh. You already looked at that. Fuck. I'm. I'm pretty sure we have the keycat. Key uh, keycat? The key code. I'm pretty sure we already do, but we're just exploring for no reason. Let me go back. I bet I bet we've been just been exploring this whole time. Hmm. 
Nope, we are missing something. Fuck. But from where? We've already been just about everywhere. The only area we can't get into is his uh, room. Huh. Yeah, where the hell are we supposed to? Wait. What's this? Happy birthday, dear. Sorry, I'm a little late. It's been a busy month. I miss you, Em. Especially today. I've put Harry... I've sent him away. For treatment. We'll fix him, Em. I promise. Development of GR-27 was too slow to save you. It won't fail, Harry. I'm keeping his room exactly as it is, ready for when he gets back. The key is with you, Em. I know you keep it safe. Wait. Norman sent Harry away for treatment? I thought he went to Europe on his own. What were you hiding from us, Harry? Uh, he Harry's wasn't hiding anything. This when he was born. Looks like Norman has made a point of caring for it now that she's gone. Beautiful. All right. Oh, we missed this something. This is kind of cute. Norman keeps all the campaign buttons from his races. There's one for school board, and he's left room for more. Setting your sights higher, Norman? Yeah, maybe you uh, try to be the president next. Hardy har har. Okay, I wonder if the... Look at all this. Norman certainly likes to remind guests of his status. I mean, all the hard work you put in, I, shit, I would put a fucking, all my hard work in a little display, even if it's just for myself, I mean, oh yeah, these definitely will inspire his Green Goblin mask, alright, maybe, uh, we go near the painting, so, I don't remember this section at all, this is the one, section I don't know. We're gonna spend the whole fucking episode in here trying to figure out what I have to do. Uh... Shiza. I might actually pause... not pause, uh... skip until I figure out where the fuck I'm supposed to go. Cause I actually am lost. Like, I have nowhere else to go. I'm pretty sure we can't go into his room. So I'm like, where the fuck? Seriously. Yeah, that's probably what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna freaking figure out where the hell we're supposed to go and then I'll be back. Yeah, that's what that's what I'm gonna do. I figured out where it is. Uh he said it's oh it's with his wife. Definitely not buried. But there is a photo. And there's a key that I didn't notice. Either it just showed up because I found out that clue, or I just never noticed the key. This must be the key for Harry's room. Bam. What? This can't be for Harry, can it? Yes, yes it is for him. Law books. Harry wants to be an environmental attorney. Like his mom. Oh, yes, the little research stations. This entire room. Why didn't you tell us you were sick? Because he didn't want y'all to know. Uh, let's see. This journal's right here. Harry's journal. His last entry is marked July 18. 
That must be the code to that room. Uh, pause if you want to read all this. I am saying we should not rush off without a plan. We? You are staying here. The antiserum is ready, and I'm going to supervise production. You will be completely vulnerable without me. I seem to be completely vulnerable with you. I'm going alone. End of discussion. Keep Team 2 on standby. I'm getting some air. Pete, Norman's cure is ready. He's headed to the Labitat now. Can you follow? Not without alerting him. Somebody spiked Sable's coffee today. Her men are set on double secret probation alert. Okay, then stay ready. I've almost got the location. Oh, trust me, I'm not getting this guy out. There we go. Oh, shit. Taze. Taze. Please hurry up with the animation. You haven't been compromised at all, Bucko, because you're knocked out. All right, let's go. Okay, July 18. Bingo. Super creepy. Gotta find the location of the Devil's Breath Lab. Something in this room must be useful. Norman Osborne, GR-27 Research Log. The whole project has gone to hell. GR-27 is a cure, not a disease. But try telling that to the evening news. Somehow, they've picked up the technician's morbid nickname, Devil's Breath and are using it to stoke hysteria. They have no idea what it's really capable of. A cure for cancer, genetic disorders, birth defects. With just a little more research, I know we could perfect it. Instead, I'll spend the next 18 months on PR mop-up. What a waste of time. Devil's breath isn't a disease. It's an attempt at a cure. I almost can't believe it. Harry and Emily's medical records. GR-27 was developed to treat them. Devil's Breath is a failed cure for Norman's own family. Can almost feel bad for the man. What are these things? Prototype hand grenades? Oh, you know, just his, um... His pumpkin bombs later on. <laughs> Norman's got a real mad scientist thing going on. If only she knew what's exactly right behind this uh, freaking wall of fucking metal. Yeah. Wow. That's the word. Norman wins the fancy map contest. Looks like the Upper West Side. Huh. This shows all of Oscorp's properties. And Sable troop deployments. Bravo, bravo. And this must be the C team. Good old Alpha team. Devil's Breath Lab must have a big Sable presence. Looks like Norman's tracking Dr. Michael's movements. Creep fest. I bet I can find the Devil's Breath Lab with this. It must be an Oscorp property with a ton of Sable protection. Frequented by Dr. Michaels. Commercial buildings. Wow. So many records facilities. Oscorp's going all in on defense reasons. No. A records facility could should check the good old out. Devil's Breath Lab must have a big sable presence. GR27. That's the code name for Devil's Breath. This is it. Tenth and Cathedral. Isn't that I knew it. 
Tenth and Cathedral, Oscorp's records department. <laughs> Perfect place to hide a secret biotech facility. GR27 Martin Lee incident. What is this? And we are rolling. I will be right next door. Just relax and let the medicine do its work. <laughs> created Lee. I, I have to get this. What? No! Who's there? Oh, no. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Damn it. We have a breach. High alert. Pete, I've got the lab location. And a lot more. How far away are you? Two avenues over. Say the word and I'm there. Great. Keep the motor running. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Why isn't he at his post? Somebody check it out. Control. I saw someone. Checking it out. Please turn around. Thank you. And fuck you. Go, 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 go. Run, run for it. Make a break for it. So much to take in. Harry sick, and Norman and Lee, and, and Dr. Octavius? I know. This is all my fault. No, not this song again. You are not alone anymore, Pete. Let Miles and me look after Feast. You, you find Norman. You find the cure. Thanks, partner.
I have to get that anti-serum and start putting things right. There must be some way to reach Leonardo. Convince them to give up this crusade for revenge. They've both done so much good for the world. They can't throw their legacies away just to spite Norman. Okay. I mean, it is Norman. Norman's on his way to get the anti-serum. Better update Yuri. I hope this is good news. It is. Oscorp just created an anti-serum. There's a cure? Oh, thank God. How quickly can we get it to people? I'm on my way to find out. The lab is at 10th and Cathedral. Wait. I just got a report of a helicopter going down in that area. Oh, no. That could be Norman's helicopter. I'd send officers your way, but I don't have any. Don't worry. I'm on it. This will all be over soon. I promise. I love how that spider uh, somehow stayed on them as they were swinging throughout this fucking city. Does anyone else find it suspicious that this rhino person always knocks down buildings and tears up roads which someone ends up making money rebuilding? Am I suggesting a conspiracy? You're damn right! Now, if you've seen the man testify in court, you know the rhino is too oh, stupid to plan tough. anything himself. So who's the mastermind? Well, who else is always there? Supposedly fighting rhino, but actually leading him around like a red cape does a bull. Say it with me, Spider Man. Uh. He always, he always assumes I have something to do with it. And also, I finally, I noticed where Fisk Tower is. I rem now, after seeing where it is, now I remember. That's... Alright, we're almost there. But I'm not going to immediately start the mission just yet, as I gotta check the time to make sure. Because I know once I complete this mission, uh, it starts the, like, the last two missions back to back to back and I don't want to uh not have <laughs> I don't want to end up screwing over the recording of not only this episode but the next one so I'm gonna check the time real quick I have enough time to actually start this mission but I don't know if I'll be able to end it we'll see got like 12, 15 so minutes your soul is mine Seriously, that's why that's what I always think when he oh, kills one of his men. Have to take care of these demons before I can follow Lee into the lab. Time to KO those snipers. Take out everyone stealthily. Sleep it off. Alright, flat pole. There's a sniper up there. Can I web crawl? I can from here. Screw that up. You literally didn't see that coming. We need to get through these demons quick before Lee gets a hold of the anti serum. I'm trying as fast as I can. It's better to do this stealthily than not at all. Shh. Easier to take these guys out there. They're split up. Two there. And mop up the ones that are away from each other, like so. Bam. I don't have any web impact. Shit. Okay, 
uh, maybe I can take out this guy quietly behind. Nope. We gotta go loud. Spider-Man, leave now. My men will handle this. Sable? Lee wiped out the agents stationed here. They're not handling anything. You have been warned, superhero. Listen, I am doing shit that y'all have refused to do. Sable made good on her threat, here they come. but these guys aren't looking to team up. Tired of you harassing our agents, Spider-Man. This ends tonight. You guys think I took out your men? You gotta be kidding me! I mean, I took out a bunch of your men earlier, but... Totally different situation. You guys were being assholes then, more than you are now. Surprisingly, y'all are being very much tame with me at the moment. God, let me move, you fucker. Why are you so heavy? You harass my men, destroy my equipment, and cost my client millions. Give me one good reason I should not kill you right now. Listen, I don't like you, you don't like me. But Lee has your client inside this building right now, and he's gonna kill him if we don't do something. We could fight each other, or we could fight Lee, but not both. Does this mean we're good? You will help me secure Norman. After that, I make no promises. Works for me. Lee's out of control. You secure Osborne. I will talk to them. Lee's a friend. I don't think you can call her a friend. No more running. This ends tonight. This is insanity. I have to find a way to reach the Martin Lee I know. A man who built feast. No way to go but down. That doesn't look like a boss fight if I ever saw one. I know about the accident. I know what happened to your parents. The accident? You sound as clinical as Osborne! Oh, the ground is disappearing. My parents died because of me! Because of what Osborne did to me! You're more than your past! Don't let it control you! I tried so hard to make my parents proud! To honor their legacy! But to truly honor them, Osborne must be justice. I won't let you do this, Martin. Lee's pain. 
His anger. It's fueling his power. Sample. Oh shit, I pressed the wrong button! Ah fuck! I pressed the wrong button so hard, I fucked it up. Oh fuck! Oh Jesus. Oh jeez! Fucking kaiju. My will is stronger than yours! 
door. We'll see about that. Can't give up. He's almost down. Oh god. Oh no. Oh no. Run. Run. Comes. Useless. on your face you can't imagine how satisfying it is ready for your final act Head doctor. There's no doctors here. Well, who's running this place? Me, mostly. Oh, okay. Well, it's been a while, but I'll do my best. I'll need masks, uh, gloves, right. whatever you have to sterile. You can thank me by not dying. Oh my god.
He'll live. But he needs rest. Find Otto. He has the anti serum. <laughs> I don't know if I can feed him. Maybe you can't. Maybe Spider Man needs help from his friend Peter. What? Peter helped build those arms, remember? If anyone can find a weakness, it's him. Go get him, Tiger. Another Spider-Man, perhaps. MJ's right. I built the neural interface. That means I can destroy it. There must be something at the lab I can use. But we'll have to do that for the next episode as we have reached almost 60 minutes if, I, if my timing is correct. Luckily... There was just a small space in between the final battle and the between the final battle with uh, Lee and the final battle with Ak to ha allow this to happen. So uh, yeah, don't got much time left. So I'll... hello, man. I gotta change this number. I must leave New York. Recent events give me pause. Your rescue of Osborne, despite his hatred, it affected me. I must return home. Reflect on this life I choose. Dang. I think I'm actually gonna miss you and your death troopers. Unfortunately, my agents will stay. Though I question our work, they do not. And Osborne continues to pay. I am sorry. So close to being good news. Indeed. I will miss you and your bizarre witticism, Spider-Man. Until we meet again. What a strange, violent lady. See you in a few DLC missions. <laughs> but yeah, uh, anyway, uh, I'll probably save my uh, thoughts about the, that final battle and such for the next episode. Uh, as we'll most likely have a big review section in that episode. But uh, yeah, hopefully you all enjoyed today's episode. I certainly did. Until next time, this is Ghost, signing out.